Hello. In this demonstration, I am going to show you how to add a local printer in the Windows 7 operating system. I'm going to start by clicking on the Start button and then left clicking on Control Panel. In the Control Panel, I will then click on Hardware and Sound. Inside of Hardware and Sound, I've got Devices and Printers and I'll left click on Devices and Printers. Inside of Devices and Printers, you'll see a list of devices that are present as well as printers and faxes. I'd like to add a printer, so I am going to left click on Add a Printer. An Add Printer wizard pops up and asks me if I would like to install a local printer or if I would like to add a network wireless or Bluetooth printer. I'm going to choose a local printer and click on it and then I need to choose an existing port either LPT1, LPT2, COM ports, etc. So I'm going to choose LPT1. Then I'm going to click on next. I need to select my printer in this lineup of manufacturer or printers or I need to identify have disk and provide the location of the device drivers on the disk. For today I'm just going to choose a printer that already exists within Windows 7. So I've got Canon as a manufacturer and I'd like to install a Canon Inkjet MP620 series. So I'll highlight that and then click on next. The default text box language says Canon Inkjet MP620 series. What I like to do is give the printer a name that identifies which printer it is. So I'm going to call it Brickhouse Labs Canon Printer. And then I'll click on Next. And the printer is being installed. At this point in time, I do not want to share this printer. So I'm going to put a bullet in Do Not Share This Printer. So I'm the only one that will be able to use this printer for now. And then click Next. I do want this to be my default printer, so I'll leave this checked. But if I'm installing multiple printers onto one Windows 7 operating system, you may not want the last printer installed being the default printer, so you potentially would uncheck the box to set as the default printer. And then I'll click Finish, and I have now installed the Brickhouse Labs Canon printer on my Windows 7 operating system. This is BrickhouseLabs.com, and thanks for watching.